Squeaky, squeaky, squeaky. Am I there? Can you hear me? A while back I saw a gentleman link to that video that I saw down here. I saw him put uh, spacers on 35 millimeter film and run 35 millimeter through his Pentax 6.7. Did you see these? These are the spacers, film back. This was before I had an actual Hasselblad X-Pan and that's what he was comparing it to, getting Hasselblad X-Pan equivalent on your Pentax. So I, of course, went and found the spacers that he was talking about, got an old roll of 120 and was gonna try it. But instead of doing it in my Pentax, we're gonna do it in my Mamiya RB. I ended up loading it up, I think it was some Ilford or T-Max, it was black and white film, and I live in this little lo local city within a city thing, and the youth, along with some other, uh, I wish I knew <laughs> what the organization was, but they were doing a march for Black Lives Matter, and it was cool because it was just through my neighborhood. So I loaded up some film and went and shot that. I'll meet back up with you after, like always. Sorry for the bad audio. Just filming this on my phone because this me is a huge thing and I'm going to be skating. So, head it down to the beginning. Oh, it's cut. Of this march and just going to take some pics. Show you a little bit of what, what's happening. Lately, everything's trembling. All my shelters are opening Feels like everything's crumbling All the windows are shattering Hold your horses, it's too cold to read Face expressions that mean nothing Dear your sadness in this bowl do you feel mine and change as in your body guessing a little bit on exposures I've already taken seven shots. I don't know how many I'll get. I've heard 12 or 13. We'll see. They got a long way to go on their march. So I don't know what the next shots will be. Documentary, documentary photography, photojournalism. It's all kind of that vibe, right? I think I have one more shot. It actually is going more than I thought it would. It's up to 16. I guess that's about right on a 36 roll. I don't, I'm not sure. Uh, I'll let you know for sure when it runs out, but right now I think I only have a few left. They're on their way over here, so we'll see what's up. To rephrase expressions that mean nothing. That was it, 20, oh, I'll just shy of 20, 19 shots, 36 roll, that's pretty good. That was super cool how the youth is super involved in Black Lives Matter and Black Lives Matter and the whole movement to just make, make it equal for them and it's way overdue. 
way, way overdue. And along with women too, it's just everything. I'm not gonna say a whole lot. About the loading of the film though, in the other video that I saw, the link down there, he used uh, or switched the Pentax to 220 to get more photos, I think. I, I'm guessing that matters. So I went ahead and did a 220 film back for Mamma Mia and loaded the film into that. Now that I've done that and now that I have the X pan and also making panos with 120 film in the old uh, Kodak folding cameras. I don't know what I prefer more. I, I kind of prefer the, the X pan, but also that huge frame from the 120 in the full folding camera. Plant, I have a shot in mind for that film and that camera. Hopefully I'll be able to do it soon. But that's it. Um, check out my man's video. Check out his video. He goes into way more depth of how to load the film using uh, old 120 paperbacks and getting it dialed nice and tight so there's no warping or crimping. Thank you for watching again. I always appreciate you guys watching and commenting and either liking or disliking. I, you know, not everyone's happy with some videos. For you that got this far in the video, I want to let you know in a couple upcoming videos, I'm going to be doing some giveaways. So make sure to stay till the end of some videos where I will announce what I'm giving away and what you can do to win this stuff. Those are to come. See you in the next one. Later.